Uh, karibu sana karibu sana mimi naitwa Banana Pedla. Banana Pedla ni yule jamaa alikuwa na support William Ruto, alikampenia William Ruto, William Ruto akaingia kwa ofisi, William Ruto ameshindwa na kazi. Na once again I want to take this opportunity to apologize to Kenyans and tell them that we are very sorry uh, for giving you a green horn uh, for a leader, for a president. Uh, we want to apologize. Uh, William Ruto ameshindwa na kazi. William Ruto has become useless uh, with these uh, Kalenjin people ruining everything in office. But today I want to talk to some of the Gusi leaders. Wale wenye mko kule upande ule mwingine wa mrengo wa serikali. I want to tell uh, some of the potential, the best leaders wale wanapendu wapa kisi. But wamepotele ile mrengo ingine na wataenda kuzama sababu ya hiyo. Sababu sahi kulingana vile William Ruto amepeleka hii serikali. Uh, you know I'm uh, one of the senior political analysts and uh, I know what is happening uh, especially in uh, the politics of Gusiland. Now today I want to talk to leaders of Gusiland. Uh, those people that are on uh, uh, on uh, government side uh, that is uh, UDA uh, and whatever. Most of them are in UDA actually in Gusiland. I want to talk to people like uh, Two people, especially, nataka kuongelesha watu wawili. The first person who has a potential to win any seat in Gusiland, but party will cost you. I want to talk to one of the finest guys, one of the best leaders, sharpest, uh, and it was Okengo Nyambane. Okengo Nyambane, and I want to talk to Chweya Matoke. Charles Chweya Matoke, chalo. These people, the two people that I mentioned, even Echate, Echate is also in that uh, category, but only that uh, the party is going to disadvantage you. Now, I want to talk to these two guys. Oh, what were we, Leo? I want to tell you that uh, you have the potential to win any seat in New Zealand, as long as mutoke pandeile ngina nyamuko, because what we are attacking to skia kitu inaito UDA, apa uku New Zealand. People don't want anything to do with UDA. I'm an Asarekari William Ruto Sai. What do I say? Because I have uh, actually attended most of the programs, uh, forums. What do I say? If Okengo Nyambane and uh, Charles Shua Matoke, Mutoke Uko. Because people had faith in you. Okengo Nyambane people, the Gusi people, Kisi County people are disappointed in you. Because you are going to be their next senator. So, Babu, Senator Asaiya, Mewatia Ibu. Uh, Ameleta Ibu Kubwa he is not going to be elected to be reelected back in 2027. People are saying that people are um, mad at you because wewe ulitoroka because they expected you were going to be their senator. Ukatoroka ukaenda. Uh, ukadanganywa uka, uka ukaambiwa uachie sijui ni nani avai uh, mkapoteza hiyo kiti. Uh, ikaenda kwa huyu onyonka sasa the person who is now mwenye ako saizi ambaye sasa ameshindwa hata na kazi yeye anataka aibe kisi county ya kule lakini governor Simba Arati akakataa hataki hiyo maneno so people are complaining that you left them kwa mata when they needed you the most ukatoroka ukaenda but people have said that they still love you and they are ready to give you another chance in 2027 only if you do two things number one, you promise them that auta toroka tena udanganywe uambiwe waachia huyu eh, we utakuja kupata na wananchi ni wao wanataka uachie tena the wrong person number two, if you switch from UDA government side ukuja azimio because another concern people are having is that um, even after you guys mkaambiwa ukaambiwa kama wewe okengo nyambane uachie eh, uachie mwenye uliambiwa uachie asimame senate akakuangusha akaangusha watu bado hata mahali ulienda kupewa mumeenda tu kukua kama errand boys okengo nyambane mtu kama wewe you are not supposed to be william ruto is a traitor william ruto alikusaliti na akasaliti wa kisi because even after taking you kutoka kwa kwa kwa, kwa kutoka kwa kiti cha unyanganyiro because wewe ungewin hata kama ungekuwa of course hiyo mrengo wewe you could win because watu wanakupenda lakini 2027 lazima ubadilishe
e, hata baada ya kutolewa sasa umepeleka wewe ni kama errand boy pale CK umepatiwa kiti because you don't deserve what you have now that shows that William Ruto does not care about wakifi hapa kusi because number one, you funded uh, UDA uh, in Gusiland more than anyone else okengo okay, nyamane they say actually i remember i saw somewhere a breakdown you spent over a hundred million in gusiland you gave them a flat an office ikakuwa offices za uda in kisi county ikakuwa zikakuwa headquarters in kwa gusi region headquarters za uda flat wewe well, ndio ulinunua uka uka uka, uka brand uka alafu ka register platinum membership platinum membership you paid one million in Gusiland hakuna mwingine alikuwa platinum membership ya UDA hata sasa hii. Yet ukaenda bado ukapewa leftovers na William Ruto. People tried to tell you that William Ruto atakuruka. He will not award you well. Lakini ukusikia. But despite everything watu wanasema wewe umekuwa errand boy sasa mumeleta aibu because ungestahili upewa hata kama ni even CS or PS position unaenda kupewa kiti ya vijana wadogo atasijui director in some office huko kwa CAK communication authority that is hiyo ni aibu sana alafu uh, tukikuja kwa Charles Chwe Matoke Charles Chwe Matoke you guys fought for UDA hapa Kisii county uli fight hata ukatoka huko kwa Mudavadi ukaingia UDA Ruto akakudanganya ukakuja saa hii umewekwa wewe ni kama blogger bwana kwa UDA party you are brighter than, you are smarter than that William Ruto anachukua watu wa kisi viongozi wa kisi hao wanaoweka tu wanakuwa bloggers pale Charles Chwe Matoke bwana jina yako ni kubwa people had a lot of faith in you wewe ulikuwa unasimama governor ukaambiwa waachana na governor kwanza waachia machogo wewe ukuje mimi nitawapanga msikue na wasiwasi William Ruto akawapanga vile anamezoea kupanga watu akawaambia wewe utakuwa nitawapatia good positions hizo positions zikapewa to other people Gusiland atukupewa PS hata mmoja since independence atujawahi kosa PS William Ruto akatupatia machoku peke yake 1 CS who is actually people saying that uh, alimpea because he is his friend na bado he is uh, disappointing people are complaining uh, the education docket is hata uh, hiyo education docket hata fadhali okengo nyambani you are a senior lawyer wewe ni wakili ungepewa hiyo kitu ama hata Charles Chwe Matoke ukaambiwa uachane na ugavana ni sawa ukawacha hata ulifanya mzuri kuachana sababu Simba was tougher. Eh uh, ilikuwa mzuri but you would have been given a good position and at least you utafanya kazi vizuri hata wa kisio. Hakuna another senior KC uh, in this government. It's only Osoro huko chini na Osoro ndiye anapanga watu wote hapa. Mnaona sasa hivi leo watu wanakimbiza wa kisio wale wenye uh, constitutional office holders. So we want to tell you watu wanasema lazima murudi azimio especially okengo nyambane na Charles Chwe Matoke you William Ruto ameenda kuwa dump you are now uh, some boys huko at sasa okengo you spend over 100 million kwa kufund uh, UDA politics uh, campaigns Gusilan unajenga ofisi ya ya 30 million gorofa unai brand inakuwa UDA headquarters alafu unaenda kuweka unakuwa uh, okengo you are my boss but you disappoint me baada ya kudanganywa sasa hii watu wanasema wewe ndio ungekuwa senator wao because they had faith in you unaenda kudanganywa unawachia nyonka mkora mwingine mwenye sasa hizi ameshindwa na kazi kazi yake ni kukimbia left right and center akitafuta eh, kitu ya kukula kwa hawa watu wengine because ule tunamjua hiyo ndio lifestyle yake ataki yeye ahudumie wananchi i want to urge uh, you leaders wale wa Gusiland come back home rudi azimio okengo nyamani William Ruto ni mkora utakaa hapo amekuweka ame... there is nothing you are doing there hakuna kitu utapata politically Charles Chwe Matoke jipange vizuri nyinyi hata kina echate <laughs> this is uh, very important nyinyi jipange William Ruto might pretend that he loves you wadanganye but the people will not like you hapa kwa ground so viongozi wala wa kisi wenye mnaona wengine mko ile mrengo hakuna kitu mnafaidika mrengo ya serikali this is the worst government Uh, in the whole world this is the most incompetent government uh, since we acquired independence in 60 years jana ndio tumesherekea so this is the worst regime of all regimes 
and wa Kisii wamefinyika zaidi mimi nimetembea hapa Kisii because i had to relocate to the village sasa sababu sasa huko town mambo ni ngumu huko Nairobi so Kisii are very mad at this government na niko sure 2027 this government is not going to go uh, to be reelected back William Ruto should prepare to go home sababu hata kuwa reelected hiyo nayo ikanashua like Gusila and itakuwa ni 99% azimio regardless of ni nani atasimama baba akisema ni huyu wa Kisii tutakuwa nyuma ba, waki, uh, baba akileta we will be behind so i want to urge you leaders wetu please go back to azimio Gusila and ni azimio anyone who will be outside azimio in 2027 and this message was of Okengo Nyamba and especially and uh, Charles Chua Matoke Wacheni kukaa huko kama mablog nyinyi ni flower girls huko. You guys are senior people. Wakili nyam, you are uh, a senior wakili okengo jambani. Senior lawyer. Charles Chua Matoke. A senior my friend. A, senior, a, a, a great scholar. Rudini nyumbani ndio mtafaidika. William will not take you anywhere. Hii ni serikali imeisha. What one is just a matter of time 2027 William Ruto na watu wake wakalenjini wake amejaza kwa ofisi waende wote nyumbani.